Hello, people of the internet. It's your boy, Carlito. What's that? Yes. <laughs> A stream uh, that tells me to watch myself. How's it going? We are here today on a beautiful uh, empty field just behind me to finally try and fly FPV live of this uh, beautiful, beautiful beast. I don't know if I can oh, I'll take that off. Uh, let me show you what the plane looks like. Oops, not like that. So this is, uh oh, uh oh. There we go. This is the plane we're going to be flying uh, today. And hopefully we're going to make it uh, fly, finally. So the difference that I have from this flight... Hey Matt! The difference uh, from this flight to the ones I had before is that I now have on this um, on this unit. I now have INAV inside of the thanks said. I have INAV inside of the plane. So fingers crossed, we're gonna check it together, both together forever. Uh, we're gonna check it live to see if this goddamn plane flies. Please, please fly. Uh, so I had to because I, I put INAV I had to sacrifice the servo for the uh, for the camera right here uh, which means that we can't turn left and right hey Dennis um, but as long as I have the I mean the camera with uh, with FPV you should be fine <laughs> all right fingers crossed guys that this goes well uh, I'll try and keep uh, you know some type of chat going on I can see the FPV as well on my phone everything seems to be all right all the servos you can probably hear them on the live stream so this is the aileron that's elevator this is rudder and then I have the there you go oh oh <laughs> that is the obvious uh, the uh, propeller spinning right so without any further ado let's see what we got shall we okay a bit nervous not gonna lie arming We've got contact oh no no let's not go plane was stuck don't worry. Let's try that again. No. <laughs> Seems to be stuck here in the ramp. Oh my god. Maybe this way. Well, let's 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 see. Let me check where the wind is coming from. It's coming, I think, from behind me, which is not ideal. So I should really be taking off that away. Uh, what's that? It will probably end in tears. Yes, Steve. More than likely. But maybe not. Let's try it. Oh my God. Why isn't it not? Uh... I can't get it to get out of the ground. Maybe here. Here? That seems a bit better. Let's try it. Whoa. Oh my god, what's going on now? Well, the problem we're having is that the prop is hitting the floor. There has to be some, uh, some surface somewhere where I can launch this. I'm thinking if I should just uh, should I just throw it one-handed? Probably not the best idea. 
FPV light build. <laughs> yeah, I'll probably do an FPV on how to rebuild the plane once I'm done. Why is it? I think. Oh, I think I know what's going on. I might have put the battery a, a smidge too forward. Yeah, that's. So it's uh, it's heavy in the front, which uh, just makes it go all the way down. So that will hopefully help. Let's put this back here. I see if that helps. <sighs> okay. All controls running well. And we are clear for takeoff. We're not clear for takeoff. <laughs> What's wrong with your plane? We will eventually get there. Don't worry. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna... I'm gonna throw it by hand. I think this prop is a bit bent as well, which is not helping the uh, case. All right, let's do it. Where's the wind coming from? From everywhere. Hopefully this will work. Good luck, please. And we're up. Oh, a lot of vibration. A lot, a lot of vibration there. Yeah. We're gonna turn softly back into us. There we go. Less prop. We're up in the air. Oh my God, I can't believe that I have worked. Uh, I think this is, I'm just flying over us. I think, yeah. It's very, very fuzzy just because I think the, I have a, a lot of prop noise, so I'm probably going to need a, a new prop, but it flies. And right now, this is, if you're just joining, this is INAV inside of this old antique plane uh, running, uh, what is it? It's 1.9.1. Uh, and, man, I love this. Uh, and I am using what's the flight controller? It's a uh, Pico BLX. God, I can barely see with the vibrations. Uh, Pico BLX. Uh, so it has six um, six cables attached to the servo. Uh, sorry, attached to the flight controller, which controls the uh, rudder, ailerons, elevator, and the throttle. Me. Right now I'm on. Oh, sh <laughs> oh my God, that was scary. Right now I'm on. Um, what's this? Horizon mode. So that means that I can I can turn a bit more. And if I set to angle mode, that's angle mode now. I'm like turning all the way to the left, and it just doesn't. It almost doesn't turn. So it's like, if you're learning, I guess it will be good for you. But I can, I can, I can feel that this prop is gonna break at any time. So I'm just gonna bring it back and see if we can land. Uh, I'm gonna do one more round. I'm super psyched that this is finally in the air. I kind of want to take my goggles and look at it, but at the same time, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try and look at it. Ah, oh, it's beautiful. <laughs> Immediately, oh shit, <laughs> immediately put my, my goggles back on just because it was so scary. Uh, in the uh, camera is uh, all in one 200, uh, not 200, sorry, 25. Oh shit, what happened? Oh, I was completely falling down there. So I'm, go I'm just gonna bring it back. I don't know what happened there. It just dived a bit to, to the left. I'm just gonna circle. Circle myself and bring it back because that was scary as hell. It might have been just some gust of wind that pushed the. Uh... 
the plane to the left. Oh. Wouldn't it be funny if someone just stole my phone right in front of me? It wouldn't be funny. All right, I'm coming in for landing. Brace yourself, guys. Where am I? I'm here somewhere. Oh, that was the best landing ever. Probably not. <laughs> I, uh, I don't know about you, but I'm, I'm shaking <laughs> after this. It was, uh, I don't know, it was rewarding and scary as hell at the same time. And I can see I have like a, both, uh, well, the prop is like bent on two places. So this is not gonna, I think that's why it's creating so much vibration. Let me, uh, yeah, I can, I can even hear the vibration. Man, I've been trying to fly this for so long and it's always been like crash after crash, but INAV, thank you. I don't know who, who first invented INAV, but whoever you are, you're a genius. You uh, finally managed to get me flying my little toy. <sighs> ah, flies everywhere. This, this is it. This is what you've been seeing uh, flying. And uh, what we have here is uh, some plane that I can't remember where they... Oh, Hellcat, uh, F4 something Hellcat. Uh, and you can see in the cockpit, there's a little uh, decapitated man with a servo right behind him. And then the camera is mounted on that servo. Yeah, that's a World War II plane. Uh, and uh, you can see here the controls in the sides moving up and down and the where is it there we go that's the rudder as well uh, but if I take this out of uh, it's not auto mode it's like it's well it, it's not acro but if I put it in acro it's just gonna fall off the sky for sure uh, so I'm gonna keep it in uh, in the current INF mode so I might just end this stream now uh, and then we can we'll see you next time I guess I do hope you have enjoyed the flight uh, if you didn't see any part of the flight just go back and watch the uh, the flight and uh, I might be able to do an HD video of this soon cheerio